Dave Ramsey made the cash envelope method of budgeting famous. I'm done with it, I quit, and here's why. Hi everybody, my name is Sarah. Thank you so much for joining me today. I am the founder of frozenpennies.com and I am a financial coach. And as a family, we are debt free. I owe all of our debt freedom to this budgeting method. But because of the season of life that we are in, I've decided, or we've decided as a couple, my husband and I, that we no longer choose to follow the cash envelope method of budgeting. Now let me start by saying, if you have a lot of consumer debt that you're trying to work through and pay off, this is the ideal method to do that. I would not, as a financial coach, recommend any other way to do it. If you have a balance at all on your credit cards, you really need to consider the cash envelope budget method. If you're looking for more information on this cash envelope budgeting method, I'm going to leave a link above to a video that I did that walks you through everything that you need to know. So here are the reasons why we no longer use the budgeting method. Number one, we no longer have debt. So we are no longer on an extremely strict budget where we're trying to meet a goal of debt freedom. The perfect people for this cash envelope system are the people who have debt, are the people who cannot control their spending when it comes to credit cards, and the people who need a very strict budget. We have graduated from that ourselves and are in a different season of life where we don't necessarily need the strictness of that type of budget anymore. Number two, it's a lot of work and I've become a little bit lazy. So this is how I used to do it. Every other week when my husband got paid, I would go to the credit union and I would take out a very specific denomination and amount of cash per two weeks. I would give them a little slip of paper. They were very familiar with my little slip of paper with the exact denominations that I needed. Then I would bring it home, divide it all up into the envelope. Some of the envelopes would go in my wallet, some of the money would go to my husband, and some of the envelopes would go into our secret location, undisclosed, can't tell you where that was, although it's not there anymore and it would be used for other purposes, sinking funds down the line. That was some work for me to do. The whole budget process for that was time consuming and I really just have had enough. I've paid my dues and I don't wanna do that route anymore. Instead of going to the bank every other week to get that cash out, two things I'm doing a little bit differently. First of all, I've decided to try a budgeting app because I found that the tracking of my spending was not as precise as I'd like to. I kind of like to micromanage our money. I enjoy micromanaging our money, so, so I've been missing that aspect of it since I stopped using the cash envelope system. Now I'm trying the budgeting app just to play with it a little bit. I'm using every dollar. I'll let you know in a future video maybe how I felt about it. If you want more information on every dollar, I'm going to leave a link below to an article that I wrote while I was getting started that might be helpful for you. The second thing that I'm doing differently is I have separate savings accounts. So the big things that we're saving for, because we no longer have a mortgage, we still have to pay taxes. And those taxes kind of lump sum come out. I'd like to have the savings for that beforehand. So I've got a couple of different savings accounts that I set aside each month the money that I need for paying off taxes. The same goes for our Christmas account. I still have those sinking funds. If you want more information about sinking funds, I'll leave a link above for that too. I still have those big sinking funds that are available for us, but they're in separate savings account instead of separate cash envelopes. When it comes to having envelopes for things like clothes and beauty, we don't have those anymore. When we need those things to be done, we will budget for them at the beginning of the month instead of saving little by little each week or each paycheck for those things because we don't need clothes. 
we don't have growing children anymore. We don't need any of those things. Another reason why I stopped using cash envelope system is because I am a mature 50 year old woman now who has learned a thing or two about money. I have found self-control. I know that I can control myself when it comes to spending money. I know that I can control myself when it comes to credit cards, even though we don't have a lot of credit cards and for years we never had any credit cards. You can do life without credit cards. We have discovered that through communication with my husband and I, it would make him more comfortable if we had one just in case. Now we do have an emergency fund, so it shouldn't be a worry, but the, it, do, it is there and it does exist if he needs it. It gives him a sense of security and I'm okay with that. I find another reason why I'm not using the cash envelopes anymore is because I want an easier way to track my money. Now again, a lot of work goes into the cash envelope budgeting system. You have to write down how much you spend on the back of the envelope or have a piece of paper inside to let you know how, to, how much you're spending on each trip or each transaction, or you have to track it somehow. Having our expenses come right out of the checking account makes it easier for me to track. And using this budgeting app makes it even easier. I found the first month that I used it, my spending was a lot different than I thought it was. So it really does put it in perspective, being able to track it through your checking account and, and or through an app, whichever way you'd like, it really does align your spending for you. It's just easier to track. You could also use, which I'm a big fan of, spreadsheets. Now spreadsheets are fantastic free resources to set something up if you would like to track something. Each column could be a completely different category. You could have food which could include your groceries and your eating out, your takeout, and your snacks. You could have a separate account for Amazon. This is something that I'm tracking right now in a spreadsheet are my Amazon purchases because I have found that through this app again, my Amazon spending is a little out of control. I really need to rein that in a little bit and decide which things that I need and things that I really just don't need at all. They just make it way too easy to hit that button. I need to get rid of the app off my phone too. That's something that I really need to take care of. Transforming my financial life over the past 25-ish years has put me in a different part of life. I find that I just don't need those cash envelopes anymore. I find that I just don't need the accountability of having an empty envelope anymore. We have grown into different people, more mature, much more wisdom in our financial journey. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I truly appreciate you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.